Mom? Let's see what else we have here, Dad. Okay. And the Lord said unto Moses, Exodus 12, King James Version, Exodus 12, KJV. And the Lord said unto Moses and Aaron at the land of saying, This month shall be, be unto you the beginning of it. It shall be the first month of the year to you. Speak ye to all the congregation in the tenth month. They shall take them every man a lamb according to the house of their fathers and lamb out of house. And if the house will be too little for the lamb, let him and his neighbor next to the house take it according to a number of souls. Every man according to his uh, eating shall make you count for the lamb. Your lamb shall be without blemish, a male of the first year. Ye shall make take it out of the sheep of the goats. And yet, and ye shall keep it upon uh, up until the fourteenth day of the same month and the whole assembly of the congregation of Israel shall kill it in the evening and they shall take it of the blood and strike it on the two uh, side of posts and on the upper door posts of the houses wherein they shall eat it and they shall eat the flesh and at night roast with fire and unleavened bread and bitter herbs and they shall eat it eat of it not raw not sodden but roast with fire in his heart and legs with the pertinence thereof pertinently this great but there's an absolute amount of pertinence holiness and it and yet ye shall let nothing of the remain until the morning that which remaineth of it until the day ye shall bear with fire and thus shall ye eat it with loins girded your shoes on your feet and your staff in, 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 in your hand and ye shall eat it haste it is the Lord's Passover for I will bring pass through the land of Egypt this night and I will smite the firstborn in the land of Egypt both man and beast and against all the gods of Egypt I will execute judgment I am the Lord and the blood shall be to you a token of upon the houses which ye are and I will see the blood and I will pass over you and the plague shall not be upon you to destroy you when I smite the land of Egypt and this day shall be unto you a memorial that ye shall keep it fast to the Lord throughout your generations and you shall keep it by an ordinance there forever thank God Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. 
gentlemen. And ye shall let nothing of it remain until the morning. That which remains it until the morning, ye shall burn with fire. And thus eat ye shall eat it, and the loins girded your shoes upon the feet, your feet, and upon your staff, and in your hands. And ye shall eat it in haste. It is the Lord's Passover, for I will pass through the land of Egypt this night and I will smite all the first of the land of Egypt both man and beast against all the gods of Egypt I will execute judgment I am the Lord and the Lord shall be to you a token upon the houses where you are where you, and when I see the blood I will pass over you and plague shall not be upon you to destroy you when you when I, I smite the land of Egypt this is the day, and it shall be unto you a memorial, and ye shall keep it feast to the Lord throughout your generations. Ye shall keep it feast by an ordinance forever. Seven days shall ye eat unleavened bread. Even the first day ye shall put away all the leaven out of your houses. For whosoever eateth leavened bread from the first day until the seventh, that shall, so shall be cut off from Israel. And it shall be that there shall be an holy convocation, and in the seventh day there shall be an convocation to you. No manner of work shall be done in them, save that which every man must eat, that only may be done for you. Right there, what are you eating? Some picante flavored... Well, okay, Jamie, and the Lord's faith unto Moses and Aaron. Hmm. Careful, we gotta be, we gotta be careful, don't we? my words forever. Seven days shall ye eat unleavened bread. Even the first day ye shall put away leaving out of your houses. For whosoever eateth leavened bread from the first day until the seventh that so shall be cut off from Israel. And the first day there shall be an holy convocation. And in the seventh day there shall be an, a holy convocation. You no matter work shall be done and them say that which every man must be eat that only may be done of you, and ye shall observe the feast of unleavened bread, for in the self same day I brought you out of the armies of Egypt, therefore shall you observe this day in your generation by an ordinance forever. And the first month on the first day of the month even ye shall eat unleavened bread until the one and twentieth day of the month at even. Seven days shall there be no leaven found in your houses, for as soon as eat is that which is leaven, even his that show shall be cut off from the congregation of Israel, whether it be a stranger or born in the land, ye shall eat nothing leaven in all your inhabitants shall ye eat unleavened bread. And uh, then Moses said unto the children uh, unto the uh, unto, unto, unto the elders of Israel and said unto them, Draw out and take your, you a lamb according to your very and ye shall take him into his house and dip it in the blood that is in the bathroom in the strike and we're doing the two posts of the, the blood that is based on none 
of you shall go out of the day door of the house until evening you know, until the morning for the Lord shall will pass through the land of the well, pass so to smite the Egyptians and you shall see the blood upon the lintel and then the two sides the Lord shall pass over the door and shall not suffer a destroyer to come in and the house to destroy you and ye shall observe this thing for an ordinance to thee and thy sons forever. And it came to pass that when, and it shall come to pass that when ye come to the land of Egypt, which the Lord will give you according to as he promised, that ye shall keep this service. And it, and it shall come to pass that when your children shall say unto you, What mean ye by the service that ye say? It is a sacrifice of the Lord's Passover who passed over the houses of the children of Israel. We smote the Egyptians and delivered our houses, and the people bowed their head and worshipped. And the children of, of Israel went away and did as the Lord commanded. Moses and Aaron did, as, did so they. And it came to pass that at midnight the Lord smote all the firstborn in the land of Egypt, from the firstborn of Pharaoh that sat on the throne unto the firstborn captive that was in the dungeon, and all the firstborn of cattle. And the Pharaoh rose up in the night, and he and all the servants, and there was a great cry in Egypt, for there was not, there was not a house dead. There was not a house where there was not one dead. Now for your mom, the Bible, you need to live out Christ's name.